I am here tonight with Code Pink Women for Peace to talk about the uh, Dayton Regional Israel Trade Alliance. Um, that uh, the alliance has recently come to our attention, as you know, because of the aggression that is taking place in Palestine currently, and um, especially in in light of the recent uh, ruling from the International Court of Justice that is allowing uh, the case against Israel for genocide to proceed, and um, the. The Dayton Regional Israel Trade Alliance um, facilitates uh, deals for purchasing weapons that could be used in um, activity that could be determined to be illegal. And so we're wondering how oversight and compliance has been put in place to make sure that uh, city and county employees do not end up being complicit in international crime. Yesterday, the response that we got from uh, Michael Colbert at the county indicated that all Drita does is just make introductions to people and that they're not really responsible. But, like, that's what they invented RICO for. You know, like, mobsters just make introductions. Ghislaine Waxwell just made introductions, and they ended up in prison. Like, that's not really an acceptable um, response. That's not how uh, oversight and compliance gets done. Um, and uh, last time I was here, we were celebrating the decision that we really appreciate that you all made to make Dayton a city of human rights and to pass the ceasefire um, resolution. And what we're hoping is that uh, we can follow those decisions up with some action so that um, Dayton and Montgomery County uh, do not end up, um, frankly, with blood on their hands, facilitating weapons deals where um, those weapons are used in a genocide. I really don't know what would happen if there was like a, a international criminal court warrant issued for a city or county employee for facilitating um, some kind of, of a technology deal where previously this, this wasn't um, an issue because Israel was not uh, engaging in criminal, potentially criminal activity, and now they are. Um, so we'll be talking more about this. I have hey, a FOIA a request comment. that I'd like to uh, hand you, and I'll wait after the meeting to set up an appointment. Thank, Thank you, you.